Water cooling has better cooling performance compared to air cooling, so do you still need to apply thermal paste if you use water cooling? Water cooling mainly achieves cooling through water or coolant, with multiple waterways in the water tank effectively transporting water flow, leading to efficient dissipation of heat. Compared to air cooling, which achieves cooling through the circulation of air in the computer case, water cooling has better cooling performance and produces less noise. However, this cooling process all takes place within the cooling system. Before this process, the heat from the processor needs to be transferred to the cooling system. This is where thermal paste is needed, serving as a thermal conductor between the processor and the water block, filling the air gap between the processor and water block and efficiently transmitting the heat generated by the processor to the water block. Only then can the cooling process continue in water cooling. Therefore, both air cooling and water cooling require thermal paste. Users who use water cooling usually aim for the most extreme cooling performance, so they spend a lot of time and cost on assembly and maintenance. At this time, using a high-quality thermal paste can make the performance much better. But also remember to be careful when applying thermal paste for best results. Follow and subscribe to Cooling Monster. Let us know what problems you have about computer cooling.